Thank you, Angela. Students who share a building where a deadly school shooting happened last month in South St. Louis, well, they'll return to in-class person for the first time since the tragedy. Fox News' Chris Renier live in South City to is what's going to be surely an emotional day, Chris. Hi, good morning to you. We are just outside of the Collegiate School of Medicine and Bioscience here at Kings Highway in Kemper. All quiet now, but in-person classes resuming here around 8 o'clock this morning. This school is basically on the other side of the building from Central Visual and Performing Arts High School. That is where the deadly shooting took place. Bomberito Automotive Group Skyfox capturing the terrifying scenes here back on October the 24th. Students and others running for their lives after a 19 year old former CVPA graduate opened fire inside of that school. Two people were killed and several others hurt before St. Louis police killed the shooter. 15 year old CVPA student Alexandria Bell and 61 year old teacher Jean Kushka were killed in the attack. The shooter identified as 19 year old Orlando Harris. Both schools were closed following the tragedy, and students have been going to school virtually. St. Louis Public Schools Superintendent Kelvin Adams says this side of the building, known as CSMB, sustained significantly less damage, and school leaders believe CSMB students are ready to return. Adams says a survey was conducted among parents and students, and it showed that most are ready to be back in person. Adam's telling us that those students who are not ready to come back can continue with virtual learning. CVPA students also will keep learning virtually for now. Arrangements are being made to have a full time therapist at both campuses here for the rest of the school year. For now, live in South City, Chris Renier, Fox News.